No! Hey, what's up everybody? This is almost certainly not Pickles, and welcome to 10 Seconds of Silence. Right now, I'm playing a game called Antichamber. And, uh, I've only recently... I tested it to see if it, you know, worked on the computer for a little bit. But aside from that, I haven't played a whole lot. And, uh, from what I can tell, it's a first-person puzzler. Uh, I saw some pictures with some kind of gun in, uh, like some sample pictures that had some kind of gun. But there doesn't seem to be any kind of enemies. And it just, uh, it's supposed to teach you something about, uh, how, the way people handle life. And, uh, this wall over here, uh, has a, has a little blurb of some sort. Every journey is a series of choices. The first is to begin the journey. And I guess that's talking about how I started the game. So, from what I can tell, this is the exit, but there's glass over here, so we can't jump through it. Uh, there's the stuff over here, so I guess this is the time remaining until it saves automatically. And then the uh, directions, but this is the map of the whole facility, I guess if you want to call it that. And so this is the first test that they give you. And so I've played enough to figure out, I haven't looked back here, that's kind of interesting. But I've played enough to figure out how to beat this one, at the very least. And so it says jump. But if I don't jump, and I just walk out onto here, the floor kind of appears in front of me. And the way it was described to me was this is a non-Euclidean puzzler. So not a lot of the puzzles are going to follow basic logic of how we understand like how space, like how we perceive things spatially. But we're going to find these. And those are going to accumulate back in that uh, first room. Uh, taking the first step can be harder than the rest of the challenge. And so I guess that was talking about, you know, stepping out onto this. Now, from what I understand, if I were to jump, then that floor would disappear and I'd fall down there. But I don't, I don't want to go down there. I saw another one of these over here. Oop. What is this? Is it? I don't think I want to step on that. So what does this one have to say? We often fall into things. No. <laughs> is this a? Is this just a hole? It's a hole. Whoa! 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 That was weird. I wonder what's down there. Okay. Whoa! Whoa, it keeps momentum! Dude, that's so cool! <laughs> that was so cool. I like that. What's over here? Uh, there's another one of those things over there in actual color again. Uh, what if I jump over this? Whoa! <laughs> the stairs. Just stairs. Now, I wonder if these have the same property as the jump. Yeah, so see, that's what. Oh, that's what would have had. Whoa, what's that? Okay, bye. Are there more of you? No, whoa. Oh, okay, it's that wall. Yeah, so what I was gonna say before I got interrupted by the pink thing was if you jump, then the floor disappears, and it's kind of like over on that jump test. What's that? That's a mountain. Small steps can take you great distances. And so I guess all these have something to do with the challenge you completed or are about to complete. Hey look, I can make them spaz out. What was that? <laughs> these things are so cool, I love them. Look at that. Nah. All right, I'm gonna see if I can get down there, hold on. Yeah, I did it. Oh, now I can't go back up. Oh, what have I done? <laughs> oh, hey, look, a pink thing. Okay. Whoa. I can still hear it. What are these supposed to be? I guess this is the way back up. 
Jump. Yeah, there we go. Cool. All right, so that doesn't really take me anywhere. I wonder what this is. Will this kill me? Whoa, that sounds so cool. It sounds like I'm underwater. That's really cool. I like that. Oh, hey. If you aren't paying attention, you will miss everything around you? What if I go back? Is that is it talking about... There's the floor. No? Yeah, I'm paying attention. I don't know. Maybe... I don't know. Is this disappearing? No, nothing. It's a blue thing. Glass. Okay, so... Whoa! Whoa, I can push it! Oh, look at that! Can I race it? No. Race it, no. Weird. Okay, so I guess I can't do anything over there. Can I... Was there another thing over here? No? Well, I think I'm stuck. So I need... So if you hit escape... Oh, hey, if you don't like where you've ended up, try doing something else. I guess that's a new one. And so we've accumulated a couple of these now. And uh, you can go back and look at them if you click on them. I love these interactive walls, they're so cool. And uh, as you can see here, the map has expanded as well. I guess this is where I, j yeah, I just came from, butterfly effect. I'm gonna go back to the jump. And so I'll sh I wanna go back here, cause I haven't seen this. What does this guy do? Up. Sauron knows your license plate and stares into your soul. Oh, it's changing. What happens if the eye closes? Whoa! That was cool. What's that? <laughs> Patience has its own rewards. Yeah, I guess. I was patient enough. What? Okay, so this is all really dark, and I don't really know. Oh, door. So as long as... This then, but I want to get on the other side. How do I do this? No, I guess I need something else. I don't know. Well, wait, what if I? Oh, this was a glass, so I can't uh, do anything about that. Nope, okay, so I guess I'll go down here. We. Whoa, there's doorways. What's that? Weird. So I haven't seen hide nor tail of a gun in this at all. What does it say? Failing to succeed does not mean failing to progress. Yeah, that's what I read earlier. Uh, so I can just barely see, I guess this is a corridor? What's that? White thing. So I'm going pretty much an entirely different direction than... I can barely see a corner here, so I can't go any further. I'm going an entirely different direction from the first time I played this. What's this? What's over here? Ooh. Venturing into the unknown can lead to great rewards. That's cool. I guess that's the gun? It's down there. Ooh, a thingy. <gasps> no. No. The end may come before we're ready to get there. <gasps> Did I do it? Oh, no. That's the exit. That's the intro room. What does that say? Life isn't about getting to... Oh. That's dumb. <laughs> That's cool. What's this? Can I get behind here? doesn't look like what are the... all right so it's two people one is one has a top hat is that I can't see it so it has where to go oh whoa 
That's so cool. See, th I guess this is what they meant by non-Euclidean geometry or non-Euclidean logic. Because that doesn't wonder if... There's the white wall. Okay. I think I get it now. So that's what that arrow was trying to tell me. So you look through the window and then you're where that window is supposed to... That's really cool. What about this? Okay. What's that? Well, gee, Arrow, you're so helpful. Thank you. Okay, so this is... I saw something here in the shadows. Oh, it's one of these. And I'm here. That's so cool. I, I got it. Try hard enough, and you will get where you want to be. Okay. So... If I right-click this... So that picks it up. Can I place them? I guess the left click is placing them. Uh, does that work? No. How about there? No. I think, okay, it wants me to place it uh, here. Yeah, okay. Oh, wait a minute. Is this gonna be the same puzzle as the demo? If so, I think I already, already know how to beat this. The gun looks a lot different though. What's this say? Some doors will close unless we hold them open. Uh, yeah. This looks a little bit different, but that'll close that. But I still have the block, so I can open it again. And there's another block over there. Let me go get that. So I can take this. Come back here. Take this one. Uh, I want to put it under this one. Yeah, there we go. And I can take this. Come back through here. Take that one, so now I have three blocks I can use. Well, so far. Bing. Boom. Let's take that one. Take that one. Put that there. Jump up here. Shoot that. What's this say? <laughs> it's harder to progress if you're leaving things behind. I guess that's if you left the block behind. Whoa. Yeah, it's the three doors thing, but it looks way different. If I do this. So putting this in opens up this one and that one. Stay on this side. Yeah. Okay, so if I put this down, I can take this one. Or not. Uh, what if I take this one? There we go. Okay, cool. Yeah. Now I can take that one and then that one. And I still have all three. Perfect. There's another thingy. This <laughs> is like a saga with that guy and her, uh, the girl at the bar. There are multiple ways to approach a situation. Hmm. So what happens behind door numbers two and four? Some outcomes are more favorable than others. It's another one of these things. Weird. <gasps> Blocks. I think. What happens if I... Do I have red blocks now? No, they're turning turning blue. That's odd. Uh, wait a minute. Am I going to lose them if I walk in that? I don't want to lose them. Oh, I can place them. That's weird. Can I? Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. So I guess that field just nullifies whatever blocks I have. Okay, well, let's continue on with this puzzle. Doom, doom, doom. Uh, place this here. That opens that door. And this looks kind of like a door. Yep, that's a door. Okay, so that opens both of those. So I definitely want to put a block here. Oh, no, that's cool. Oh, wait a minute. I remember this now. Uh, I remember not being able to beat it. Hmm. So I can take that one as long as that's in there. That opens two doors, so I don't want to take that. I need to put a thingy... No. But then... Wait, I have an idea. Yeah, because I saw that earlier. So if I take that, because that 
that definitely closes it because I was in the demo. Uh, if I put that there, take this one. What happens if I jump over it? No! No, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted at all. That makes me sad. Oh, another one of these. Yeah. Jumpy. Jump. Oh, that's cool. How do I get down there? Jump. Can I jump high enough with enough force to get down there? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna pass that up. Uh, place those there. Because I don't know what that does. Place that there. And that there. What does this do? No. Uh, I don't want to... I don't want to activate that. I don't want to activate that. Uh, I don't want to activate that either. So I'm just gonna... Oh. Oh, I saw these, and I thought, I was like, okay, I've got some blocks, but no, I guess I need, uh, yeah, I need all four of them. Four of them? There's only three. There's the one that I left behind, these two here. Can't take that one. <laughs> I'm gonna try to get down here one more time. Okay. Yeah, because there was something else that could move that there's a blue block in the way. So these actually have some kind of physics to them, I guess. So if I do, oh, there's another one. The consequences of one choice can cut us off from making others. So what? what's down here? Oh, I need to put a block, there we go. Uh, keep my, oh, oh. It, now see if I had three blocks then this would be easier what's behind door number one well I I can't really go anywhere back up there so I might as well block myself in here nothing here there's not always a secret floor under them okay we'll see what's through this door it's another block god that would have helped me earlier <laughs> Oh, wait a minute. So if I had two in here, one holding this up, I would have gotten a fourth. I could take these, this, and that, go back over here, and then take the block again, and I would have four up there. But I'm, but I'm kind of stuck down here now. So I'm just gonna take these, and I'm going to escape out of here. I don't get to keep the gun. That's not fair. <laughs> I can't. I guess that would be cheating. Uh, I guess I gotta go back and get the gun. Oh! Once I have the gun, I don't need the gun. I don't... I just can't take it back to the escape room. Okay. <laughs> uh, just for grins, I'm gonna go in here real quick. Yeah, this is the right way. Ding! <laughs> yeah, we've already seen that one. Oh, no! No! <laughs> it's not fair. Uh, let's go back through here. Uh, let's see if I can follow the dark. Oh! That's kind of cool. The art style in this game is really good. If I haven't mentioned... Uh, if I haven't mentioned, the game is... Uh, this game, in particular is by Alexander Bruce. And from what I understand, uh, they were working with a small team. They were working with a small team to make this game. And uh, they did an absolutely amazing job. Let's read this one. Some paths are clearer than others. So I guess that's hinting at the other dark path that's not outlined. Oh, I like blue. I like blue blocks. Uh, okay. A choice may be as simple as going left or going right. Um, so they want me to go left to see what's down there, but I want to stick to blue. Okay. I guess they want me to go left, so I'm going to go left. 
<laughs> I think as the choice doesn't matter if the outcome is the same. Uh, maybe you just have to go through one of these long enough, or maybe you have to know the pattern. Nothing new. Uh, just a wild guess. Okay, so I don't really know the uh, the pattern there. That's where I was. Uh, stairway to heaven. Let's try this over here. Oh, they react to... Oh, I see. Uh, shift is walk? I didn't think I'd need it, but I made a mental... Okay, yeah. So, those kind of destroy the white blocks. Ooh. Taking one path often means missing out on... Does that mean I can't take the other one? Yeah, because I saw this door open and that one fall. But I kind of go down here. That's kind of cool. Oh! That's not the wall that I'm looking. Yeah! Yeah! This is what I like to see. That's really. Whoa. That's really cool. What are these? The end? But we only just started. I guess we can't get there yet. I guess that's the real end? That's weird. And everything changed. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> Well, I think I'm going to have to cut it here. This is going to be the end of episode one for Antichamber. Uh, I'm probably going to make another two episodes of this uh, all in one sitting. And uh, let me know how you guys think of the game. I think it's really cool so far. And from what I've seen, it's available on Steam. I saw uh, some cool stuff on it uh, about it on Steam. It's not like a new game by any means. Uh, and I remember, I remember playing the demo, not a whole lot, but at least some, uh, you know, a while ago. But uh, let me know what you guys think. Leave it in the comments. Uh, like the video if you like it. Uh, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. This has been 10 Seconds of Silence. I'll leave you guys with uh, the picture of the end here. <laughs>